Um, I started Hellblade 2 as well. I literally played like very little of it. I just wanted to see the graphics, to be honest. Um, man, I don't know. I I remember really enjoying the first one a lot. Um, but I remember when I finished it, I was like, okay, I hope they don't make another one of these. I don't want them to make a sequel because I'm just done. You know, some, some games just need one. And some games need a long time in between. Um, that's why I love Bethesda when they do like Elder Scrolls games. There's so much time in between that by the time the sequel comes out, you actually want another one. Whereas other franchises, it's like, do you really want one every year or every two years? Um, even three or four years is too soon sometimes, depending on what kind of game it is. But this game took like, I don't know, six, I forget how long it was, but I feel like it was announced before this entire generation even came out of consoles um and i don't don't know i was really anticipating it but as it went on i could kind of tell the developer was starting to i I could tell what was going to happen because the developer was saying things in certain ways like hey uh, you know we just wanted to make a game that was like this and i I think we did that and and i don't know it it, it came out and and got a lot of meh scores from a lot of people um but also some high scores as well. But I, it, it's looking like it's going to be what I thought, which is like, I don't know if I really want just another one of those games because the first one wasn't perfect. Um, I looked past some of its flaws because at, at the time it was like, oh, it's an indie developer making this game that looks AAA. Um, and the story was kind of interesting. The visuals were amazing. Um, the fighting was kind of cool at times. Um, and it was short, which I love. And the sequel is kind of just doing that again, I think. Again, I haven't dived in too much, but from what I've heard from people, it is kind of just doing it again. And some people say it's actually a step backwards from the first one. Um, but I will say I played the first, like, I don't know, half an hour. And it's so slow. Like, the the I remember, I remember the first game opens up on a very slow way as well you're just walking or you're in a canoe or something that it takes forever but this one's on a whole a whole other level like you're really just you're 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 just crawling around so slowly listening to this story all these voices in your head and like there's a one section in particular where she she takes like a literal like five real-time minutes just to climb up this like little hill and I was like, oh, I can't. I just wasn't in the mood for it. So as soon as I got to a point where I thought I could save, I think I like it was like the prologue or something. I just uh, turned it off. I'm, I have no real desire to go back into it, to be honest. I don't think you know, I'm sure it'll be fine when I when I actually am in the mood to play it. But I at the moment have no desire to play it. I don't think I'm going to enjoy it. Um, hey, thanks for listening to this clip of my podcast. I publish new episodes on the last Friday of every month at 1245 p.m. PST for all premium members of my Patreon. My name is Cooper Bebo. I'm an actor, writer, and producer of film, television, and video games. Head to patreon.com slash cooperbebo. You can sign up for free, get access to my blog, or you can toss me a few dollars if you want to support me and get special bonuses like this very podcast, or you can subscribe to my YouTube. You'll continue to get free clips and a brand new video every single Wednesday. So whether you like to watch, listen, or read, I've got something for everyone. I've also got a video game called Billy Saves the World. Please check that out on Steam right now. I've got movie projects in the works. I update all of that stuff in Discord all of the time. Again, the basic channels are free to join. Just head to patreon.com slash cooperbebo to get access. Thanks again, and I'll see you in the next clip.